Hi everyone, my name is Nathan Paul. Oh. Hi everyone, my name is Nathan Palmer, and if you remember me from last year, I went by the name Superman and I was taking off my clothes, and I'm really sorry about that. And if you want to see that video, click on the link below. And... I don't think we're good enough for that. Don't ask us to do that. And my piece is called Charismatic Mellow, and my French pose is called is Adieu, which means goodbye forever. And you'll see why. And I'd like to dedicate this poem to a one special someone. Yes, Nina, Charisma Mello. We were five when we met, and I knew I wanted to marry you. I know that sounds crazy, but you have to know that I'm crazy for you. We were five when I loved you, and you hated me for reasons unknown. Maybe it's because you love me too. I like to believe that's why you treated me so coldly in the last recent years. We were five when you moved away. I don't think I realized what I had lost until now. I remember asking every day where you were, and I patiently waited for your return. Hold on. Just gotta do something. We were seven when you came back, and you loved me. You held my hand, gave me gifts of affection, and always kept me close, wanting nothing more than to be by my side. But my eyes were on someone else, yet my heart was still for you. It always was. We were nine when I made you cry. Yeah. And I felt horrible for hurting you. I remember telling my mom about it. She gave me a bracelet to give to you to show you how I felt and to tell you I'm sorry. I only said sorry and you hugged me. I feel sorry now for not saying the rest. We were nine when you left again. For the longest time, I could not put my feelings for you into words like I can now. I was nine, give me a break. And though we drifted apart, the thought of you still lingered on. We were 11 when you finally told me you loved me. And we were 11 when I broke your heart. And I never meant to do so. I wish I wasn't so blind. To see who I had was everything I could have ever won. And I let you slip away again. We were 13 when I was going to tell you how I've been truly feeling about you for the longest time. And ask you to be mine for the day. I wanted you forever. But a day with you was all I could have. And you could have had my heart like I always intended. We were 13 when I patiently waited for you, with a bouquet of roses in my hands and my arms ready to wrap around you, to hold you close and tight, and to spend the greatest day of our lives together, to make up for all the years I lost with you. I waited and waited and waited some more. We were 13 when I realized you were never coming, and I had to come back home. You never told me why you didn't show, and I'm still waiting at 18. We were 15 when you said you were coming to visit me. My heart running wild. I wanted to be everything to be perfect. The plans we made, the moments we were going to share together, and the time we were going to make count. We were 15 when you never showed up again. You told me, maybe next year. We were 16 when maybe next year came along. I wanted to make the most out of the time I would get with you, but all you wanted was to party and get wasted. We were 16. <laughs> we were 16 when you made your choice of what you wanted, and it wasn't me. We were 17 when you told me that you were too ashamed of yourself to see me. That all you did was cause me pain and heartache. I was too good for you. I deserve better. That I should leave you behind. 
You were right. But for the last 12 years of my life, I loved and wanted to be with you more than anything in the world. But that didn't matter. You made the decision for me and left me behind. We are 18 now and live our separate lives. It's been that way longer than I ever wanted to admit to myself. And now I want to make my peace and truly move on with my life by saying this. You are my first love, the one that got away. I'm the one person I love as much as one person could love another. But I think it's time I get going. You already did. I love you passionately. I miss you terribly. But you don't need me anymore. You haven't for all these years. And now, I don't need you. Thank you. <laughs>